All right, fuck it. Since I'm on a roll making shit, um, first thing I did was, because you've seen all my totes and shit back there, well, this is what I did. I don't know if there's a video I made. I can't remember, so I'm making one now. I'll put it up tonight. Um, I've been using styrofoam because I got a ton of it. Because um, my wife's dad does vinyl siding, and they've been saving it for me when they do posts and everything. This is actually from a cooler, but it serves its purpose for what it is. And it's real lightweight, so I ain't putting no bricks or nothing there. And what I've been doing is I've put three quarter inch holes. Um, since I can't find my paddle bit, I took a drill and put it just below this. So it's not the water is not setting up here. And this here is going to be where my um piece of plywood goes. And that is this. This came from a travel trailer that I took apart. Well, I didn't. A big machine did. We'll leave it at that. In a matter of a whack or two. And I'm putting that in there. Since I ain't got my damn sawzall, I'm using a pair of scissors. And as you can see, bam. I was going to put this on the bottom, but I was like, ah, it went that way, so it worked. I took a piece of that and I stuck it down in there so that way it helps block anything from getting in there in the hole and then I mix my dirt soil dirt whatever that there is one of those is going in this so I'm gonna cut that and drop it in this but I'm going to mix some of this up with some of that. So that way it's um, loomy enough. Because this here, I think, is riverbank dirt. They said it's topsoil. I think it came from a riverbank somewhere. Because the way it dries. But hey, all I do is add a little, a little this and a little that to it. And poof, I got it working label as high as you can get it this is bork 9 because it's going to be exposed so you got to make sure you label it real high oh and i got to put where it came from ah came from white hot peppers so far they've been pretty good expensive little fuckers though but so far so good. And ditching, but I did it on both sides. I put some of the topsoil from there into there. And then I got it crammed down into there, not real tight, but enough to where it'll stay put when I move it around a little bit so I can drag it where it's going. And it'll help wick up some of the um wick up the water from there up into the soil and then it'll travel from there. I had to put a little bit more down but so you get the idea since at the about half of it you just put shit dirt whatever the hell you got I mean it really I don't care what anybody fucking says it really don't matter because all that's proof it don't matter but this next step really does matter you have all that I'm gonna mix that together but I also have Trace nutrients, or trace um, elements, zinc, copper, all that shit. I got a 44 pound of that. And I have something I concocted together from last year. All the extra stuff that I had, uh, fertilizer and everything else to help them in. So I got all that there. And then I got triple 13. Yeah, I know, that's cheating a little. But, uh, it's to help out a little bit because I really think this dirt shit. So, what I'm going to do first is... Oh, 
try not to step on my AJ Fantasies. First thing I'm gonna do. This is a um, quarter cup of the trace elements. All I'm gonna do is sprinkle it. Because as it gets watered, it'll be fine. Then I'm gonna take another quarter cup and I'm gonna sprinkle it on what's gonna get mixed. And before any gets the anybody gets the bad one saying blah blah this and you got nutrients block bullshit. Look at all that. I don't want to hear it. I've done the same thing. All these ones here that have one plant in them originally had two. Some of them had four. That one back there has got six. But it's in something way bigger than that tote. It's size for a tree. So, back to what I said. That, I did my little concoction of Job shit and uh, scraps. Uh, Eco scraps is the name of the other stuff. Quarter cup it. I didn't pay a lot for it, so now I'm gonna mix it together. I took and mixed it together, half ass, and I put it in there. But I made a mound in the middle. That's what you're gonna wanna do. And by the way, that tote there, that's not the original ball. It was half the tote. I cut what I need to cut for it so I can do this. You set it just like that in there. If you want to massage it and break it up, you can. If not, don't even worry about it. Because I've done both and it turns out the same either way. But make sure you make that ball or that mound so this will set and it'll be almost, almost flush but not quite flush to the top. You want a little lip to catch water. So if you think it's a little high, just push down. Okay. Now, all you do... Just take the remainder of your dirt and fill it in. Oh, and um, I was putting a whole egg too. I didn't bring the eggs out with me, so, and I'm only doing two today. But I'll bring some eggs out and do it tomorrow. And yes, the eggs work. They really do. And if you got some fish guts or something like that, stick it in there. You put the egg underneath the bottom of the ball. You just set it there. You don't break it. You just set it there. And I'm telling you that shit works. So now you get the point. Now I take this opportunity. If I have something like that plant there, how it's got some of the stuff touching the bottom, some of the foliage, I'll cut it off. If that was touching down there, I'd be whacking it off. Okay. So now, you whack all that off and take all your bad leaves and just start cutting them off. They look pretty bad like that. Make sure you know what the nutrients is lacking first before you do it so that way you know what's going on. And look up underneath them. You see that one's got, it's been chewed on, so you look underneath it. Yeah, it takes a lot of time and it's June and that's why I'm only halfway through. I still got 30 or 40 more plants to do this. And before, where's the thing? Oh. And before you finish putting the dirt in, put whatever fertilizer you're using. So you, it's kind of buried. So since I'm using triple 13, you just sprinkle it, whatever you're using. I just started using triple 13 because that other stuff that I had, I'm out. And this, I was having issues with a lot of other stuff because of the rain was washing everything out. So I had to steroid a little bit. For a tote that size, 
on the bag, you figure out how much you need. I figured out I needed a half a cup. So that's what I put. And I figured out the same thing on the other one because of what I use. I've been using five gallon buckets. So, and now all you do is cover that up with a little bit of dirt and put it wherever you're putting it. And that's all I've been doing. I mean, hell, you've just seen my harvest of what I just did last weekend. And now it seems like almost everything. Devil's tongue shot right up. So, I mean, what I'm doing is working for me. You can alter it however you want to suit you. And by the way, you can cheat if you want it to. Oh, shit, I didn't get it all. Ah, fuck. Oh, well, you can take and do what I did. And since you got the other half of the tote... Just take and mix all the other shit together in the other soil or whatever and just throw it in there. And then when you put the fertilizer on top, put the fertilizer on that side, not the side, the newy side. So then that way, between them together, the nutrients will soak back up and it'll mend all of them. I haven't tried it, but theory is what I've been doing works for me, so I'm going to stick with it. This is the last one I'm adding to this fucking video. <laughs> but I've done another one, Big Black Mamas. And when I told you about whatever dirt you put at the very bottom don't mean shit. Exactly what I said. Because that there is clay. Oh, and I got a little worm, too. Let me relocate him. Oh, there's another one. Relocate him. Okay, back to what I was saying. This is shit dirt, literally. <laughs> shit. But somehow or another, I end up with little wormies in here. That I have no idea. Maybe because I dropped one or two here and there or whatever. I don't know. Or well, they crawled in the hole. Don't know. But that was all on the bottom. And you can literally see it. That's the bottom half of it. The top half had what you've seen in the other one. The um, real good stuff. So it don't really matter. Now, this is the good stuff. Because I did that. So it don't matter.